what's up guys so I just got some new 7-eleven foods and we're gonna try these out these are the hot Cheetos Thai brand hot Cheetos we're gonna try these out see if they are like the original ones and I got some probiotic milk Meiji cherry flavor and some egg sandwich oh also forgot to mention I got a latte near the 7-Eleven. They have these everywhere. Not this exact brand, but coffee shops everywhere. So this whole thing costed me around 100. So this is this is 86 and this is 30. Yeah, we're going to try these out. These are sweet potatoes. These are good. These are like Japanese sweet potatoes. They taste like the exact same thing. I think these are Japanese sweet potatoes. In Japan they call them yaki emo. But these, I don't know what they are in Thai. Good. I was wondering if they could like heat them up, but they taste good cold. I don't think they need to be heated. Okay, this is a hot Cheeto. Definitely does not look like a hot Cheeto in America. These ones are not spicy. It has like a tiny hint of spicy. And it's kind of sweet. They taste more like uh, Funyuns. Yeah, I've even had the original, I mean the, the regular flavor of these and they taste pretty much the same. Just a tiny bit of spiciness. Egg sandwich. Pretty good. Has the egg, egg paste, mayo, egg, and then of course the white bread. I prefer wheat bread, but this is pretty good. And this, you can customize it and tell them if you want more sugar. Ninoy, small. Mak, a lot. Uh, Namtan is sugar. And then latte, latte. A lot of a lot of English words in Thailand are just said in a Thai style, like la latte, latte, and cold is yen. Latte yen cup, cup is please. I'm not sure which coffee they use but it's pretty good. That's the 7-Eleven mini food haul. Peace. What's up guys? So I am near my school where I work at on the weekends and my student canceled. So I'm gonna show you guys this area that's around it. And uh, you know, show you guys something new. I've never been to this place, but <laughs> check it out, they got uh, burgers with the E-R-G-E-R-S. That looks nice. I bet they have an infinity pool up there.
they don't have this in America. These are uh, top-up stations where you can pay your bill, shopping, transfer money, pay for gas. I got my drink. Milk tea place. I have these in uh, several different places. Cool, you can pay uh, with the QR code. That looks like the guy off from Ape Escape. This is a plaza. So here's a KFC. Free Wi-Fi. They don't have that in America. Most KFC places don't have Wi-Fi in America. I've never seen more than one with Wi-Fi. The chicken here tastes different. Seems like the recipe is a little different. The massage place. They have a scale to where you can weigh yourself. Here's a bathroom. They don't have a hose in this bathroom, but usually they have a hose. But they have trash bins, so where you can throw your toilet paper in there. Because the toilets cannot handle toilet paper. Just a random Einstein. I don't know why. Pretty cool. They got Gamera stuff. Godzilla stuff. Gundam stuff. Guys, what's up? So I'm at a restaurant that I go to sometimes. It's near the gym, and uh, we're gonna eat some food. And I'm gonna show you the gym. Let's get it. Okay, so this is Pit Gang Mu Gap with Kai. So this is crispy pork pepper curry with rice and egg. This is like kind of a spicy flavor. It's not super uh, classic curry flavor, but has a pepperiness to it. And the egg is, uh, you know, just a normal egg. It's like fried egg. Live, eating it live. Pork is tasty. Crispy pork. Tastes like pork fat. Peppers, onions. These are green beans. It's 
good. This dude has fire in his neck. Oh. Savage. The gym is right over there. This is the spot. It's near Midnight Chicken, which is a place over there. And it's near the O2 gym which is where I am about to go. Here it is, O2 gym. Here's the different levels. One year, 6,000 baht. Six months, 3,500. Three months, 2,000. One month, 900 baht. One day, 60 baht. And I'm gonna work out. As a preview of what's in here. I personally like this gym more than the gold gym, the go gym. We got a scale right here, air conditioning inside the treadmill area. I was gonna do some cardio, but I decided to walk instead. So it's rainy season right now and it's only been raining a little bit this year. It usually dies off around November. Yeah, it's been pretty nice so far.